What's going on, world? What's going on? My name is Daniel Chazibani, and welcome to another episode of Power Up Wednesdays. Super excited, and you know, every single Wednesday, I come and share an audio experience with you on how to keep going, especially after a um, Tuesday and um, the day before Thursday, you know, middle of the week. And so, what I really want to get off my chest and share with you today is um, what you can do at your laziest. You know, um, I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to title this episode, Lazy at Best. You know, when you are tired and you are like, just like relaxing, man, you know, uh, just chilling and you don't feel like doing anything. This is, one of, this is probably one of those, the most um like you you have a platform let's say the laziness and you're chilling that's a platform for you to sit down and put all your ideas out there you know um lazy at best use that platform while you are chilling while you are relaxing and some of you might be chilling with your friends use that time to learn from your friends study your friends study try to see something in your friend that you could possibly use to the next person or with the next person for example let's say you are lazy today you don't feel like doing anything um you're just chilling and you know unemployed and maybe you're working or not maybe you're not satisfied with something so you're just chilling and you just want to be creative man like in the back of your mind, you want to be creative, but you do not necessarily have the motivation and drive to get up and do something practical. And so this is what creatively, creatively, like this is a creative um, example. Just think about one day, right? Think about the word, the words one day. You know, you hear it a lot. One day is one day. But if you were to think about it really, think about it really, one day is every single day. And so if whatever it is you want to do one day requires you to do it actively, practically on that day, why not doing it today? Why not think about like that thing of yours, that thing that you really want to do, like, like, you are lazy at your best. You are relaxing. You are chilling. Mchana. Let's say you want to buy a car. Now, 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 I am not in a position to talk about buying a car because I have never bought a car yet, right? And so, I thought about it and I saw it will work. But I'm not going to buy one. I'm just not ready to buy a car yet, you know. So let's say you want to buy a car and you are at your laziest. You are chilling. You are thinking of buying a car, right? And in your mind, you are thinking about the amount of money it requires you to have in your bank or in your possession. Bear in mind, you are lazy at your best. You are chilling. You are thinking of buying this car. And let's say this car is about 70,000 rand, right? It's a seven, this, this car is worth 70,000 rand. You have never driven a car yet. Not yet. I say. And you want to buy this car. You've nev- you don't have no knowledge about how a car works. You always see it on TV. You always see the Mustang. You always see like the... Like guys are driving, spinning. You always see it in the streets, wherever you go. And you're like, I want to buy myself a car one day. You never had time to learn about the car. The ins and the outs about the car. What model should you buy? The kilos on the car. Like every ins, the engine, you know, the gearbox. You have to check everything. You have never had time to do all of those things. And now, long story short, most of us 
think about doing something and we are not really doing anything. We don't want to do anything because it's too much. It's easy to think in this context of buying something, of buying a car. It's easy to think about it. It's not good, not bad. But if you're not doing anything about it, it's just a dream. It's just a thought. And so it, it goes down memory lane unless you do something about it. Now, taking that out of context, right? Don't let you being at your laziest best get to you. I mean by that, Ellen Watts said, um, thinking is hard. That's why most people judge. So when you are lazy at your best, right, and you go out there, out there in the big bad world, don't envy anybody. Don't go out there, um, okay, look at that, look at that, look at that. People are suppressing you, they're doing this and that. Don't, don't be malice in your attitude and your personality because remember, thinking is hard. In other words, having empathy and sympathize with people. Like trying to understand why somebody is like that. Why some people are wearing certain things and not judging it and not judging that person, right? So you have to learn and teach yourself how to think when you are lazy at your best. That's what it really had to come down to. I had to come down to stop judging yourself and stop judging other people. As soon as you stop judging yourself and as soon as you stop judging other people, you will begin to learn how to cut down the whole world, how to kill the noise, and you will learn how to do the stuff that you've always wanted to do on your own terms, in your own time. You will do things rapidly, like you would like kill the game. <laughs> you would kill the game, literally kill the game, because you know what happens? You will learn... Okay, you have mastered now how to be productive when you are lazy at your best. And so some people will not get it. When you say you are where, where? when you say you are boring or you are bored at home and um, you don't want to be bothered, right? They're gonna go, yo, what well, like bruh, what like we let's hang out. And you'll be like, no, I got to do something. And then they're going to be like, yo, bro, but like, you're not doing anything. That's why you say that you are productive and creative. Listen, man, I'll see you in the next episode of um, Power Up Wednesdays. Super excited, super duper, extremely, extremely excited. Now, I'll see you in the next episode. Let's go. Yo, 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 before you go, Daniel Jazibani has been nominated as SA's Best Upcoming Artist at the Love Your Dream Awards. If you wish to see him hold that award, SMS the keyword LYD award one to four five six double three. That's LYD award one to four five six double three.